Greetings to you too. Okay. I haven't made a video in months, not months, like some days. And um, I intended on making another video in regards to the Jersey Shore, but I didn't get to that, so I apologize. Um, I don't want to make it seem like I because I have on a dress. Um, so, well, I hope you guys are all having a happy Sunday. I'm having a pretty chill Sunday myself. Um, just got back from church. Um, what else? It's been really, really, really hot these past couple of days, but I am not complaining because we started the new year off with lots of rainy weather and gloomy weather, so I'm not tripping about it being hot. So, um, on to important things. Um, I was just thinking to myself about, you know, black history coming up and, you know, this is... Martin Luther King Jr.'s um, holiday is coming up tomorrow and I was just thinking about like what African Americans contributed to American history and I was just like wow I went online and I actually did some research on well not research like in depth research but I did research on like African American inventors and I found out a quite bit of interesting stuff. Um I was amazed that some African Americans like they invented things that had to do with the sciences. So I was really intrigued by that and um you know like everyday things like a mop, a ironing board, um things you use around the house like, did you guys know that an African American invented the airplane? I didn't either. So, it's just a lot of things that I was just shocked about. And I was just happy to know that, you know, one of my people actually contributed something to American history that, you know, is useful not just by us, but by all different types of people. So, I'm really happy about that and I am happy about being African American because a lot of people they take us for granted because they feel like they could still treat us like how they did years and centuries ago and I'm here to tell you I'm in that generation where you know technology is like how technology is our way of living now so we know a lot more things and we are more hands-on than you know past generations so um i'm just happy to be an intelligent african-american female attending college and furthering my education and things like that so yeah um <clears throat> on to other things i just want to i'm just like Take grasping like um all these like different social networking websites like for the longest I did not know what Tumblr was. I was like what the heck is a Tumblr? Like I did not know what a Tumblr was. But it's basically just like reblogging pictures of things that you like or you find interesting or that you just wanna do it because you just wanna do it, but I like Tumblr. And uh, Facebook, it's starting to get a little boring to me, you know, even though I'll be on there, I just, I'm just getting bored with it, so, anywho, um, Twitter, I been, mean, I became, I had a Twitter for a long time, <laughs> right, Kiwi Red, follow it on Twitter, that's two D's, not one, um, yes, so, I've been a really, twi I've been tweeting like crazy, for the past couple of days, it's, it's, it's really addicting, like, at first I didn't get it at all, like, what the heck, how do you, like, retweet and reply, or whatever the case may be, how do you use the tweet a message, blah, 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 all that other stuff, but Twitter is legit, like, now I see why a lot of people have it, because it's legit, and you say whatever you want, when you want, nobody can stop you. Um, <coughs> On to other things. Uh, I'm so excited because my show is coming on Real Housewives of Atlanta. 
I saw uh, they showed a new episode. I wasn't too crazy about it. Like Kim trying to sing. I'm not even gonna go in. Whatever. That's my show. It's, it's entertaining and I like it. So um, I'm not too crazy about the new season of Bad Girls Club because these girls are whack. Like bring Tanisha back, bring Natalie back, like, these girls are, like, not happening, like, and then they find girls in the, like, like, strangest areas, like, Minnesota, Wyoming, Kentucky, crazy places like that, like, anyway, I advise y'all not to watch this season of, um, Bad Girls Club, because it's whack, wiggity wiggity whack, um, the game. I'm excited that the game came back on, but it was just too much going on in the first episode, but, you know, it's been two years, and it's been a long wait, so we'll see what these writers have up their sleeves, and you know it's on BET, so you only, y'all already know we finna get like 15 minutes of the actual show, okay, but, yes, yeah, so I'm not even finna go in, um, I'm so happy just to be here, and just be able to talk to you guys and just vlog if you want, if you may or however you want to call it. Um, what else? Oh, I have dreams and aspirations on becoming a public relations specialist. Um, so I don't know if I want to like work with the company first or just start my own firm after school. I think I should like get experience by working with like a firm first and then like build my way up. I think that will be more beneficial for me. But yeah, look out for that. You know, your girl's doing big things. Um, but yeah, it's a lovely day out. Well, evening out. Afternoon, whatever. I can't even see the time on here. I'm blind. It's a lovely afternoon out. So just continue to enjoy your day. Oh, I live in California, by the way. You know, we having some of the bombest weather right now. Oh, my goodness. Um, what else? I don't know. Like, uh, I'm just so excited for the semester to start. It's just so many things. Um, I have my fingers crossed because I want this job. I don't care. Like, it's a lot of people complaining about having the actual job that they have. But it's like, they don't understand. Like, it's some people out there that don't have jobs still. Like, you can't be like, oh, I can't stand this job. But you're getting paid. Look at it as you're getting paid. Simple. Anyways, um, so this is just my video just to express how I felt during the week and what have you and um just continue to enjoy your day and i hope that this video kind of brought something positive to your day until next time bye